Hello viewers, welcome to my channel Picture Fun. Today we are going to learn how to make fantasy scene or how to create little bit mysterious scene in Photoshop. So let's begin our tutorial. First we are going to take a new document or new page. Just click on file and select new. Then take any size, I take this one. 1920180 and make resolution 300 because this one is very important so then press enter or click on create so your document is ready now we are going to place some images and we are or all we are going to create a background so just place this one first and adjust the size of your image as per your document or new document page So this one is placed. Now we are going to place more images such like this one. This one is the terrific image and you can download this all images from my description or I provided the link in description. You can download this complete images. Just place this one and adjust the size of your image as per your work so this one is placed and just zoom out or zoom out your image and we can see that the image is perfectly placed and we are going to add more images such like this one this one is the temple image just select loso tool and select your temple image and simply drag and drop this one in your new document and place this one behind your gate and simply place this one like this so this one is placed and we are going to remove this image so just take a mask go to brush and adjust the size of your brush tool by using bracket key and simply remove this one first make opacity 100% and remove this one so this one is almost done and we are going to blow out this image first so first go to filter or we do this later just we are arrange our work first and take this image also and simply drag and drop this one in your new document and place this one behind this and just like this one so this one is perfectly placed and we are going to take a mask layer and remove this area just zoom your or adjust the size of your brush or make a little bit bigger and then simply apply this mask layer so this one is done and it's look amazing now we are going to place our model this one is the very important part so just zoom your model by pressing ctrl plus and for selection use pen tool then start your selection when you complete a selection simply zoom out your image by pressing ctrl minus and then press or right click and go to make selection make feather edition 0 then press ok so the image is completely selected and now we are going to place this one in our new document or workplace. Adjust this one like this. This one is the perfect place I think. So this one is look good. Now we are going to blow out this temple image. So just go to filter select camera raw oh sorry this one is wrong selection just cancel it 
go to filter and select blower and go to blow and gases blower and increase the blower effect a little bit more and also blower this image also the three images go to mask and remove these lines so this one is almost done and we are going to apply shadow so just take a new layer go to brush make foreground color black 100% opacity and apply this and adjust this one by holding shift key adjust this one as per your work so this the shadow is placed perfectly and it look amazing now we are going to add some more extra images then we are going to apply a little bit hair or we are going to add more hairs to provide amazing fantasy look so this is our hair image and we are going to take this one and place in our model set this um, side and it's look like flying hair change the color of your hair by using a click on adjustment layer go to hue saturation and click this one clipping click on clipping mask and colorize click on colorize so this one became blue so this one is not blue so just increase the whiteness and increase the color of this work i think this one is little bit So the color is completely matched. Now the mask this one. And duplicate this one. And now we are going to place this one perfectly. duplicate again and this time go to edit transform and select flip horizontal make this one one more time duplicate and adjust in that place We also hiding this one, so just duplicate this one. Oh, sorry, just adjust the size and place it in this area. And now we are going to use mask layer to complete our task. also apply this one little bit sorry take first take mask layer and apply this one and also in this one so the 
fantastic look is already already looks and now we are going to separate or we are going to provide different look so just take a new layer go to brush and select white color and apply this white color between background uh, between gate and temple image and go to mask layer sorry not this one this one go to mask layer take a brush decrease the size of your brush and remove these lines because this one provides you little bit different look again make duplicate and go to edit and transform and select flip horizontal select this one so this one is placed and make again duplicate this one and this time we are going to place this one in upper side just place this one in upper layer adjust the size of your branches or this image and again duplicate this one and just go to edit transform and flip horizontal So the work is almost done and it look amazing and now we are going to finalize our work so just select or add click on fill adjustment layer and go to color balance and balance the color of your work i think this one is must be blue and decrease little bit can color so this one is look great and now we are going to mask the complete layer in one layer so just press shift control alt plus e then we can see that the complete layer is masked in one layer and just duplicate this one this one is just for backup and go to filter select camera raw and now we are going to adjust the color of complete part just decrease or decrease the highlighted priority and go to split tone and increase the highlighted area such like yellow and darker area make blue there is a great difference between blue so just i think take this one this one is the perfect go to saturation and increase the saturation and increase little bit clarity so this one is done and also increase sharpness then press okay the work is completely changed and again go to filter and select nick collection and color effects pro This time we are going to increase the strength a little bit lower. 
like this and increase the shadow area also. Then press OK. So the work is almost done and we are going to take a adjustment layer. First we are going to take a brush on new layer and make foreground color gray and increase the size of your brush and make opacity like 8% zoom out your image and apply this and again zoom your image by pressing ctrl plus and go to adjustment layer and select photo filter and orange is perfect then press ok and again go to photo filter and this time we are going to select like kind color then press ok so this one is done and the work is almost completed and go to adjustment layer and select gradient this one is perfect then press ok go to filter and select this one as a soft layer so it's look like a little bit mysterious and look like completely a fantasy scene so if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel see you soon with new tutorial goodbye